guys, um, so today I'm going to be doing a different kind of video um, and I'm going to be dyeing my hair yeah that's right, dyeing my hair um, I've, I'm dyeing it natural dark cool blonde um, I just felt like I needed to do something for my hair my hair is really messy it's at the moment greasy as well um, I've only gone really over it this morning with the hair straightener but I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna get them. I've got two of them, and I'm using a nice and easy one. Um, and it's a permanent colour, and it's grey coverage, even though I have no grey in my hair as it is, and it's long lasting too. So I bought these one because it was two, it was two for nine pounds in Tesco's, and it gives you an intense care, shine, and smoothness. I am really, really scared. I don't know what to do. But I'm going to be showing you when I dye my hair. I'm going to have my boyfriend to um, film it for me when I'm in the bathroom doing it. I've never ever done it before on my own. I've had my mum doing it, but I've never ever had it dyed my own hair. And it's not going to come out like that either. But it says that on the back of it, it's got your current colour to that colour, blah, blah, blah. But I'm thinking, my hair's ginger. But it's got blonde streaks in it, so I'm scared this is going to go really dark and it's going to go a bit lighter this side. But I'll waste away. If it don't turn out right, then I'll have to go to the hairdresser's bone knife. Okay. Anyway, I've got these two just in case. Hair. Um, what's it called? A clip. And my brush my paddle brush I bought and it's babyliss one and I've got a towel sitting right next to me so it could just go round my neck so then I don't get it on my clothes I should really wear an old clothes but I just can't bother to get changed to be honest anyway let's get on with dyeing my hair I'm gonna brush my hair first does anyone else like wearing these I'm using these like hair grip hair bubble things I really like it because when I have my hair up as well, if I straighten my hair, if I have my hair up, it doesn't may have a kink in my hair. So yeah. So I'm just gonna brush my hair out. My hair's so greasy guys, like I need it done really bad, like washed as well. I wanna show you what's in here quickly. We've got the instructions and we have some gloves so I've got a six no three pairs of gloves I've got these ones the other ones in the other box and my other half's um, mum gave me some more gloves just in case I need them so and where I've only had it on I, last time I dyed my hair and I was in school and I was like 15 16 years old um, so I'm just going for um, 25 minutes not the 20 minutes anyway we've got in here we've got the color activating cream and then we've got the color blend formula tint and also we have got the conditioner but I will for brilliant blondes so I'm thinking that will make my hair a bit blonder so let's go and dye my hair Now I'm going to pour this into this. So I'm really scared. I've never done this in my life. My own. I think you pour it all in, don't you? Yeah. Oh, oh, I hate the smell of it. Smell that. Whoa, oh, what is it? Oh, I didn't realise how big. It's like bleach and licorice. That's all of that. Now I'm going to put the lid, lid back on. I might need the second one because my hair is quite thick as well. I'm just going to go for the sink so. Put that I'm going to get a towel now and wrap it around my neck. For that, I'm going to put 
a hair bubble around it. So, like so. I'm going to dye my hair. So it's before, and my necklace is coming off. Necklace, bracelet. Starting the roots, apply color mixture immediate to dry unwashed hair. Oh, I need gloves. What am I doing in my life? Right, now I have done that, I'm going to open this, I'm really scared by the way, now I'm going to apply the roots. I'm not a professional. My eyes are really watering. My tinge, tinge at the top, tinge. But yeah, we need to go and rub all that off afterwards, and I'll see you in a moment. Now I have finished keeping it on. I am now going to wash it off, and I am going to use my shampoo that it says "My Hair Matters Smooth and Shine." Um, and then after that, it says I have to put this on. I don't know if I use it all, but I probably will. But it says two minutes for brilliant blonde, it says, so maybe it's in my hair. I'm so scared. <laughs> right, it's getting hotter now. I'm going to put these on for now, so I don't get it all over my hands. Right now, moment of truth. I'm going to wash it off. Look at that, it's purple. What is purple? I don't use a race. I don't use a that much, I think. <sighs> Gotta keep it in two whole minutes. So, it's not taken at all, and my face looks really bad by the way, but it doesn't feel like it's taken. Um, it still looks the same colour as it was last time. The bottom bits look a bit, I don't know if it's just wet, but the bottom bits do look a, bit darker than it does at the top but it's really annoyed me because as you can see my hair is still ginger so I'm just going to dry my hair didn't take at all that is really annoying but I can't do anything unless I go out and buy another one well, it seems a tad lighter. It seems like I've got the blonde bits in my hair have gone ginger. I'm gonna spray some of this in my hair so I can straighten it. It's a Tresemme, uh, what's it called? Heat protecting spray. Spray some in my hair. Put this bit up. And now we're gonna straighten 
more. Okay. It does actually look a bit lighter. I might go a bit darker next time, like practically go darker and get brown hair colour. If anyone knows why it hasn't taken, or is my hair too light for that um, that shade, or also who else has had lots of snow? I couldn't go to work yesterday because the trains were cancelled from where my boyfriend lives, so um, I'm stranded in um, where I live, where he lives as well. We got so much snow. I don't even remember the last time we got that much snow. I was up. Uh, I was mind blown, I was so excited. You asked my boyfriend that. Like, I was really, really excited. Um, we built a snowman, which I'll put up soon. Um, and I'll show you. Because I might, who wants to see like a, a montage like, of what I've done from last year to like near now. See, it has got a tinge, of, I've got a bit of blonde in there, but it looks like it's going a bit lighter um, but I don't know if I open the blinds in a minute and then I'll show you the finished result but my hair is still the same colour as it was when I started and it is really really annoying I was excited but scared at the same time and now it's now not taken so I ain't got nothing scared about. My hair has has gone actually gone a bit lighter. So if I can just move you and I will show you how light it has gone. It's not taken at all. You see, like not taken at all. But oh well, this is a foul video so had lots of snow <laughs> so yeah this is finished look it's not gone how I want it to go but hopefully I'll go for I'll go um, darker next time I think but honestly this conditioner has made my hair so soft I might have to go and find some somewhere so if you really like this video and even though it's a foul video look it's not taken whatsoever um please like and subscribe down below and then i will see you next time if you want to if you want to see me do any other videos um and oh i'll do a makeup video i can do a get ready of me in the morning video or whatever or i could buy some clothes and i do like a whole asos or boohoo or something like a, a plus size um haul like I did my Primark haul um, and that got about uh, near enough 200 so about, about 300 views just under 300 views and I'm really excited so yeah hope you liked this video guys and I will see you next week or the week after one because I'm not I'm no good at uploading so see you later guys